Hey guys, welcome back to the watch mission. Uh, this is kind of part two of the oil filling uh, process. So the glycine that I did oil fill before, again, turned out great. Uh, I, I, this is my favorite one so far. I just love the way the dial looks. I mean, it, it really brings out the blue. Uh, and, and, you know, I mean, even though this isn't a copper dial, it's just a coating, it looks awesome. So I think this watch was somewhere around I want to say 400, um, you know, it, it's, a, it's a pilot watch uh, uh, quartz. And this time, uh, kind of on the advice of a couple of people that, that I met with recently, I did leave just a slight little bubble in there. Uh, and I guess you're supposed to for uh, temperature changing reasons. Um, however, on the glycine, this one still doesn't work after a new battery. And I'm it's got to be something, it's got to be something so simple. So uh, I'm just not a quartz person to kind of try to figure out what that is. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this, but it looks great. Uh, let me try to get it focused there. So there you can see the bubble a little bit. But there's the look of that dial, right? I mean, you, you can just see it from all angles. Looks awesome. So that was the first one um, that I did. And uh, this one, uh, this is one I got uh, from AliExpress. And uh, it's kind of cool because it has a, a, dome, uh, a dome crystal on it. So the, the glycine is just you know, completely flat. So that one doesn't extend out very much. But this one, another blue dial, again, it kind of looks black and blue at the same time. Uh, it, it really does extend. So I'll try to go this way with it. And you can still see parts of that dial, you know, almost when it is perpendicular to the camera there. So, you know, another cool result. And it has one or two little tiny bubbles that are in there, but I can't even see them right now. But that one turned out great. But my favorite one right now, uh, this uh, uh, Torgan. So I haven't tried the green dial yet. I love the way the green looks. I think it, it really, uh, really brings that shine out, that uh, sunburst of the green. So you guys tell me what you think. Um, tell me if you would like me to try some more, what kind you'd like me to try. I'm definitely hooked. I've, I've got the process down now. Uh, but, you know, I am going to, uh, I'll probably sell this one on whatnot as well as this. I might even go ahead and sell the glycine as well just to go ahead and see if someone else knows how to fix it. Uh, but don't forget to join me on whatnot. Um, I'm not sure yet when I'm going to do it. It's probably in the next, probably right after Thanksgiving, I I'm guessing, somewhere around there. Uh, I'll get past Black Friday and, and uh, do it then. But um, also don't forget that I'll be giving away um, the About Vintage watch. Um, and I just gave away the four zone. Uh, so this is uh, one that I gave away on my Discord. And, and as I mentioned uh, in the video, on the giveaway video, there was only four people uh, on my Discord that entered. So I'll be doing more Discord giveaways as well. Uh, you know, stuff like this, um, the Pagani design, um, which I haven't done the review on it yet, but I can kind of give you the spoiler alert well worth the money. Um, that is a killer dial on there. It's, it's going to be a little hard to see until I put up the video that has the macro shots, but uh, they went with a textured dial. Um, so it's a Daytona look and quality is outstanding. Just, just an amazing job for the money. So that's probably one that I'll do. Not sure if I'll do it on the Discord or, or not, but I will be giving more stuff away on the Discord for sure. So you know, you can join me there and um, have a very good chance of um, winning something there. Tell me what you guys think of the oil fill, and um, I will be doing more very soon. Thanks.